My name is Markas and today I'm going to show you how to install a multiball. When you receive your unit, it comes in a box like this, including all parts of the frame, the console, sensors and even some balls. Before you get started, it's always good to make yourself a clear plan where your system will be installed, where the projector will be mounted and how long the HDMI cable should be to connect them both. Once you unpack your system, you will find an installation guide taking you through all the steps to install all parts of the system. It's always best to start with the lower middle mounting frame and then attach each part while making sure everything is perfectly aligned and straight. After you mounted the console, it's time to attach the sensor bars in the order shown in the installation guide before connecting it to a power source. We generally recommend to use a network cable to connect the unit to the internet to ensure a stable connection, but Wi-Fi also works. As soon as the computer is powered up, the projector connected to the console via the HDMI cable will receive a video signal showing the multiball menu. Now you only need to adjust the projection so that the display picture fits exactly into the frame. Then you're ready to test the touch functionality for the first time. After the first test, you can attach all the covers, take care of some small cosmetics like hiding cables, and you're ready to have some real fun.